I'm sure at some point I'll be able to harvest one of these harmless robot dudes. Commencing. Oh boy! We're doing the fishing minigame. I'm using Robuddy as a as a little as a little bobber. Catch lost. What the hell is this? <laughs> Catch lost. The wind Catch condition lost. has got to be. You throw a little Robuddy out there. You wait for him to bob a little bit, because that'll indicate a fish decided to bite onto whatever it decided to bite on. Hey, got him. Report. Success. I gotta kill a fish. Complete. Okay. That's That's not something I was expecting. And really I would just let me beat up on one of these nerds until we... Wait, man, he... Oh. he... He did way more damage to me than I was, uh... Than I was expecting. <sighs> At least the beeping isn't horribly annoying. It could be worse. It could be one of those nonsense beeps like in Ocarina of Time where it just will never, ever shut the hell up. So this is the resistance camp, huh? We should probably go talk to their leader first thing. I'll talk to the leader first, who's clearly this guy. You're number two. Hmm? You know about 2B? Um, yes, well, the bunker told me to expect you. My name is Anemone. I'm the leader of the android resistance that controls most of this territory. You must be the new scouts we heard about. My well, parents named me sure after an underwater organism for you. because my parents Please are feel sadistic free to ask them anything assholes. you like. Sell me food or healing items, please. I named my child Sea Cucumber because I'm a piece of shit. Let me just stock me up on all this shit. You can ride animals. What? What? Yeah, just, just, just throw, just throw the, throw the chump healing items at me. I'm getting one of these and I'm getting animal bait. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm totally riding animals. So you can purchase plug-in chips from this guy if you can get raw materials for him. Please shut the hell up so I can get my Target hero. location data obtained. Mark. Not bad. Okay. Subquests. That's much better. If 
you do this this sub quest for me, then I'm gonna give you stuff. That's what we do here in video game land. Everybody has a little little fetch quest to do. Places crawling with enemies that you must kill. When you kill the enemies, you'll get the doodad, and when you get the doodad, bring it to me. He's wearing a goofy... I forgot the guy's name. Well, whatever. He's wearing a goofy Yoko Taro mask. How do I save? This, her name should just be Fourth Wall Lady. I guess they get a free pass because the character you're playing is an android. But I think there's going to be, with the release and subsequent success of Detroit Become Human, there's going to be a lot of games that are doing the Android thing. There's going to be a lot of games that are trying to get away with their, their freebies. Because, oh, you're an Android. That's why there's a HUD. That's why there's all this fourth wall breaking. I feel motion sick. Eventually. Oh, so I can teleport between checkpoints. Which are these little... No, it's... Yeah. No. Okay, so, when I say something's driving me bonkers, B-O-N-K-E-R-S, bonker. Not bonkers. I'm not English. The way English people say things is all busted because for some reason they decided to drift away from their natural accent. If you don't believe me, then uh, there's historical context for that that I don't want to bother getting into because I'm just some asshole on the internet. Okay, so I've got little questos that are floating around, and I've got access points. The world is filled with cleverly disguised access points, which can be used for the following. Blah, blah, blah. So they're disguised as vending machines and the like. This must have been quite a city once upon a time. Too bad vegetations claim most of it now. Operator 60 to 2B. It is time for your regularly scheduled contact. This is 2B. Nothing to report. Good to hear. Say, how's the weather on Earth today? Good? It's fine. Does that question have anything to do with our operation? Not really. I just figured it might feel nice to have some good weather. Feeling nice has no bearing on completing missions. <laughs> that is so like you, 2B. Anyway, talk to you later. This is the place that weapons trader was talking about. Uh-oh. I'm picking up hostile machine life forms.
Okay. Okay, you can't just spam dodge. It doesn't work. tells me the default zoom level for combat while designed for the game is uh, kind of shit. But they're just like, no, oh, we're not putting in the QA time to make it so the camera zooms out correctly. So, eh. I don't think they put the QA time in for the PC release at all. They just said, fuck it, and, you know, it is what it is, and people can have fun with that. If not, fuck them. I wasn't expecting to be able to climb this thing. There's some collectible doodad over here. That oh, should be enough. The, that's the collectible. Let's doodad. get these back to the trader. Plant life has claimed most of the central area. Big plants too. Report. Records show that vegetation has grown to an abnormal size since the departure of humans. Hmm. Wonder if there are any huge boars and such too. I wonder if there are any huge boars, like the, the horrible huge boars that were in the, the regular near game. The, the huge boars that you end up riding, and for some reason, like, incredibly strong. I never actually played it, I just watched somebody else play it. But. It's not a vending machine, it's just cleverly disguised as one. Anyway, I think they're gonna have a lot of those little tongue-in-cheek references to the original game. Collectible doodads. Yeah, I won't kill him. I only killed the moose for the lulls. <clears throat> and I killed these guys because I hoped they would drop healing items. Is there a quest? Indicator. Distance camp tool shop can't make plug in chips. The owner has a bad leg. He needs someone to gather necessary materials. I need broken circuit, broken key, and small gear. Well, it says that they're in this area. Oops. Okay. Eat shit, mister. I don't know, I think I have to kill him to get the bits. Okay, that's yeah, everything the supply trader the asked for. Now I just have to kill him for fun. Man, these I'm chores a, are a real pain in the butt, butt, huh? The Resistance is a valuable ally to your house. By helping them, we also help ourselves. So no, I don't think they're a pain. Yeah, yeah. These fetch quests sure do suck. Let's make it better by being self-aware and calling these fetch quests lame. 
that doesn't excuse fetch quests existing. Eh, I think the game looks fine. I think for all intents and purposes, judging this game right now is a little... It's a little early. Okay. I'll spend all that money I don't have. What if my weapons are just making my friends die all the faster? Well then, you're a horrible friend. Sorry. Oh boy. oh boy. This is the kind of game this is. Beast Bane, Beast Lord, and Ancient Overlord. Ha. Ah. Well, I think this upgrade that uses all the materials this dude just gave me is an incredibly large amount of stats so I'm gonna commit to that yeah it looks like weapon upgrades are gonna be the meat and potatoes of this game holy moly Getting a little philosophical for me. Did you read that? He said that the only part of him that is original that has not been refurbished or replaced is his left leg. He's replaced so many parts that if he replaces his left leg, would he even be himself anymore? To that, I say, let's think about something else.